Oh no. I dropped some in my shoe. <laughs> oh three Credo and Ron Ron the producer. Oh what's it called? Load it up volume one. Yeah. Load it up. Yeah, yeah, load it up. I can kinda of see where where we went wrong there. Yeah. What did you think of it? What's your your overall thought and then we'll go into depth. Overall thought. Now, I just want to make sure. <laughs> a lot of this was done through a prison phone, right? No, I don't think so. No? Well, I didn't think so. Because in, in the intro, he said, uh, like, while he was on the run from cops. Like, because he has, like, the... Because at the beginning, it has, like, the... You the have prison a call phone call, or yeah. whatever. From what I can tell, he knew that he was going to get caught eventually. But he's so, been in there for ages. How yeah. long has he been sitting on this? Well, I don't know. But he's still been releasing fairly steady as well. Yeah. But he, um... Yeah, from what I can tell, knew he was going to get caught eventually, but first wanted to just record a shitload of tracks and albums yeah. and stuff to keep his family fed. Yeah. Well, overall, I don't... I think this album is just, like, too a bit, like... It's got, like, good songs here, bad songs here. Like, it's, like, all hit and miss. There's no real, like, um... Consistency. Consistency to yeah. the whole album. I think Ron Ron was decent. Mm. I think Ron Ron knows how to sort of make like a, what would you call this, sort of like a trap album. Yeah, I guess I it would be that. like pretty standard trap. A few of the features weren't that great. Mm. Like I think uh, Greedo was like obviously the best. Um, I really did like the Chief Keef feature. I think that was probably the best on the yeah. album. I think that whole song was the best on the album. Um, okay. Bands in the Basement, if anyone wants to know what track that is. But uh, all right, why don't you get a little bit deeper into it and then I'll, I'll jump in I thought you could tell the album was rushed yeah and sort of like recorded while they were both in like sort of a perpetual state of sleepiness Guap that's probably the first track with any sort of uh, notable features that thing was absolute shit <laughs> with True Money did not like it either I think so yeah it is oh mate you're all over it I'll play just a little bit of that. Like, that's two money, isn't it? Oh, Zed money. Oh, Zed money. Yeah. Yeah, and a Greedo. Yeah. It's like... I did like what you said about the sleepiness. Yeah. Mm. It's like it was sort of... Half, half arsed, wasn't it? it Very wasn't. much so, yeah. But yeah, that's a good way of putting it, I think. Yeah, the songs themselves are all that bad throughout. There are some just straight up bad songs like that. The melody is quite terrible, but especially in the first half, I noticed the mixing was just terrible. Yeah, that's very, very muddy. That is why I thought it was done in prison. Because it was like so weird sounding. Yeah. Like, I would turn it up and it would just not like, do anything. <laughs> <laughs> it was just really weird. Like I couldn't really hear anything. Yeah, like I was, was turning just it up. It all at once. Yeah. I'd turn it up and I'd be like, oh, I want to hear like Greedo more. And then it just, <laughs> the music would go louder. And then he'd stay the same. It was so weird. Yeah. I, I noticed that straight away too. Yeah. Like that, I, I feel like that heavily diminished the quality of it. Like, even if the song was, like, good, which the first sort of couple were, yeah, it, 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 that's just sort of ruined them, and yeah. I can't really listen to it. Yeah, My Little Fantasy was all right. It, I did really like the melody on that, actually. Yeah, Key Glock on the next track straight after it was all right. Mm. Uh, Drip Going Deep. But then Gucci of My City, I mean. Didn't really like that. The features weren't that great. What, what, what were they? Ralphie the Plug. Mm. Kirchie the Great. <laughs> And Desto Dub <laughs> wasn't the biggest fan of that track, but Chopper Holder Hunted. That goes dummy hard. Yeah. That was, I, I did like that. That was one insane, actually. that track. Yeah. Oh, and Willie the Sensei. I like that name. On no, Wally. Is it Wally or Willie? I thought it was Willie. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was Wally, but you might be right. I, I got the two money wrong, so you might be right on this one. <laughs> oh, it is Wally. You're right. Okay. <laughs> not well, one not... for one. <laughs> <laughs> One each. I think you should rename himself to <laughs> Willie the Sensei. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, I thought that was actually really bad backstage. Backstage? Yeah. I, I I actually read 
I was doing a bit of research for this album, mm. and I read that people had that as like one of their favourites. Really? I th- I was a bit mid on it. I didn't love it, didn't hate it, mm. but uh, yeah, I did hear that uh, uh, some people did enjoy enjoy. It. I'd assume for the Greedo part. Yeah, but I know, I'm I'm not massively hate. I'm sort of just leaning slightly towards mm. dislike. Right. Um, mainly because I I know it's not an album for lyricism. It was very poor on yeah. that track. Yeah, you're not wrong. Um. Uh, two quotes here. Bitches be tricky, is you of age. Let me see. Okay, you good. Turn the lights off. <laughs> oh, turn all the lights off. <laughs> and then even worse was, could beat him on a bad day with probably one hand. <laughs> <laughs> no hands on Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest, I might not be able to do it with one hand, but I could. <laughs> Potential. <laughs> yeah. About 50 50. <laughs> oh, that's really weak. <laughs> the worst song by far, though, for me was Extradited. Or didn't Extraditing. Like that. Extradited. Extradited. Yeah, yeah, people also like that one as well. Really? Yeah. I don't know if he was like. Leaned out or something, but he he was spreading some rubbish on the chorus. Why don't Why don't you play a little bit? Let the Let the fans decide. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, that's a good idea. I'm gonna skip it forward a bit. <laughs> My more rap sort of went out, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, Greedo sort of. They're attempting to resurrect it. <laughs> what if it uh, Does he know it's dead? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he recorded this years ago. Maybe, yeah. Maybe that's it. Maybe, okay, we got to take it in the context of two years ago. <laughs> Just like, I don't like the... <laughs> I got the jitterbug, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to see some more jitterbug memes. <laughs> Um, yeah, not my favourite. <laughs> the chip. <laughs> oh, I haven't heard that word in like 10 years. I'm going to get the lyrics up right now. <laughs> what is it? Extra, dieted. Did he say Jitterbug? I swear, I swear I heard Jitterbug just then. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. 03, Greedo. Oh, it doesn't even have lyrics. <laughs> I'm looking up the <laughs> lyrics for Jitterbug. Doesn't even have lyrics. This is ridiculous. Wait, hey, I'll just scrub back a little bit and see if we can hear it. I swear I heard Jitterbug. Oh, wait, hang on. I, uh-huh. I think it was Gucci Flip Flops. <laughs> like, you can hear how that's Jitterbug, Gucci Flip Flops. <laughs> when we say it like end. that, yeah. All right, well, he oh, doesn't say jitterbug, which <laughs> puts it down even further in my eyes. <laughs> I didn't like the end of the album, Miami Vacation, and what was the last one? Call In with Runway Rich and Rob Vicious. I do like those two names, though. Yeah, Rob Vicious is a good name, but a trash artist. Yes, I do not I didn't like... like either of his features in that album. Did he have two? Yeah, one in an earlier track. Oh, yeah, Mind Right. Yeah, that yeah, one was Yeah, Mind Right was actually a pretty good track. Yeah, it was pretty mid for me. It was all right. Um, not bad. That's fair. It was a little bit repetitive. Sada Baby? What do you think of Sada Baby? On um, Cross the Map? I don't remember it. Yeah. I thought it was alright. Mm. I didn't... I, I think that that's a theme for me throughout this whole album, that the album yeah. was just alright. Mm. Do you have anything else to say? Um, yeah, about um, Miami Vacation, actually. I thought it was a mid-song, but the last ten seconds went off. Yeah. Like, that's where Greedo was just like... Was just pumping out lyrics like a submachine gun or something. Oh, like a Uzi. Like, I will play it actually because right at like the last couple of lyrics, you can hear him like running out of breath, and that that's the most effort I've heard him put into anything. Yeah, I, I did really like it was, that. Yeah, it is nice. Oh shit! But. There is, there's going to always be a cap to how hard you can sound when your mm. voice sounds like that. Because <laughs> it's like heavily auto tuned. Like you can't really sound super hard when you're auto tuned. I do agree. Like that, when yeah. you hear like Saba or Joe Purple or, mm. or someone just like screaming lyrics, yeah. like Dan, like you're like, oh, that's like. Because that song there, 
that will never give me chills, you know? Yeah. But, like, someone doing that in, like, a real authentic voice, just, like, yeah. at the, like, right at the end of their breath. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know that they're giving it their yeah. all. There's, like, a cap. Yeah. And even though he's given the same amount of effort, just with the auto-tune and with how sort of soft-spoken his voice is... Yeah, it just general, doesn't sound as good. Yeah. Yeah. But it still sounds good. Not mm, yeah, as it good. does. And just one last thing I didn't like was in... Um, Oh, what track was it? Band in the Basement. In the first half of his verse, he had a few ad-libs, like, whoa, hey, oh, <laughs> like that. And it would bounce between your ears. Oh, yeah, the, the 360. Didn't, yeah, I didn't like that. It, it took me away from the song. Yeah. Kendrick um, Lamar did it the best on one of his songs. Yeah. When he did, Do You Look Both Ways When You Cross My Mind? And then it, like, went across yeah. the, the earphones. Um, Kanye did it as well on... um. Oh, fuck, what track is that? I don't know. Yeah, I have no idea. Um, oh, it goes like, Look at you, look at you. You know that one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do. It's all My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy. <laughs> yeah. I swear it's the one of the two that I just said. <laughs> no, no. Look up, look at you. Oh, no, God, look. what the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Runaway. Look at you. Yeah, it's Runaway. Is it? Look at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We push it to yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that one does it. Like the, look at you, look at you. Oh, yeah, yeah, and yeah. And that's yeah. just to make it feel like you're surrounded by people. Yeah. Which, it's fair. He does it well. I think the last thing I've got to say about it was, uh, at times... Oh, I can see your rating. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to turn this off just to... Uh, uh, to keep the to... keep the surprise. <laughs> I don't want to ruin it for future albums. Uh, um... At times they did manage to make something okay. Yeah. But because your brain was so used to everything below that, the okay sounded good. I can agree with that. Um, and yeah, over an hour is just far too long. It is. For almost any artist. Yeah. Let alone one like O3. You're not wrong. Um, so yeah, you already saw my, my thing. Um, so I'm going to end on one of his quotes and then with a rating. Yeah. He's running up a check like a Czechoslovakian. You're not wrong. It's a three out of ten. Three, oh, three and a no, half out of yeah, ten. Three and a half. So my bad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to give it a five out of ten. Five, okay. I think it's pretty, like, I can't, it's very hard for me to give under a five just mm. because there's always at least like two or three songs that I'll be like, okay, I can listen to that. No, I didn't like an entire song. And There's always like one like bit a in a song run. I didn't like. There you go. All right. Well, yeah. three point five and a five, so he gets an eight point five out of twenty. Yeah. If you keep in score, not too great. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, be sure to check us out later today for a song of the year of twenty nineteen. Oh wait, yeah. Let me get mine up. Right. We're climbing the ladder. <laughs> See you then. That's a wrap.